As of today, the uh, state of Maryland has administered more than 2,250,000 COVID-19 vaccines. Making progress in the fight against COVID-19. More Marylanders now eligible to get the vaccine. Hello, I'm Denise Koch. And I'm Vic Carter. Governor Hogan says it's a race to vaccinate as many people as quickly as possible as coronavirus variants continue to spread. So here's a look at the latest numbers. The number of hospitalizations in our state on the rise again. So is the percentage of people testing positive. Today, the governor announces new mass vaccination sites. And WJZ is live. Ava Joy Burnett has more on the governor's announcement this afternoon. Have a joy. Good afternoon. Well, as of today, anyone 60 and older will be able to sign up to get a vaccine starting today. And speaking of those mass vaccination sites, they will be doubled by the end of April. Today, Governor Larry Hogan announced that 34% of adults have already gotten at least one COVID-19 vaccine shot. The governor also announced that starting next week, more vaccines will be sent to the state. We are fully prepared for an increased supply from the federal government. As Maryland prepares for an increase in vaccine availability, officials will be setting up 12 more mass vaccination sites across the state, including in Howard, Anne Arundel, Baltimore, and Harford counties. The first one that will go online will be at the Timonium Fairgrounds on April 5th. We also uh, continue to have ongoing discussions with other counties and other partners regarding potential additional vaccination site locations. Starting today, anyone 60 and older will be able to sign up for a vaccine. They join all the individuals in phase one, which includes healthcare workers and teachers. The number of Marylanders who've been fully vaccinated has steadily ticked up to more than 800,000 people. That's about 13% of the population. Starting next week, more people will be added to the eligibility list. And on April 27th, Every Marylander, 16 and older, will be eligible to sign up. More than 8,000 Marylanders have died from the coronavirus. But each day uh, truly is now bringing us one step closer to that light at the end of the tunnel. And next week, Tuesday, anyone who's 16 and older with a disability will be able to join the line to get a COVID-19 vaccine. They're able to pre-register starting today. Live at 4, Avajoy Burnett for WJZ.